Good day guys, my name is Sarafa and I am one of the community mod at SafePal. Today we would like to talk about how we can successfully back up our phrases on iCloud. This has been a cutting edge technology been introduced by SafePal to further enhance its users um, for an optimum security and furthermore save their faces for those who has um, multiple wallets who would like to back up their faces online as well as those who had their phone lost or maybe one way or the other they um, forgot saving their phrases or writing it down so this has been a technology for us to leverage on. So we quickly open our Safe Power app. Since it's a um, guide, we add a new wallet. We create a wallet. Just input in my Safe Power transaction password. We name this Cloud One. So the wallet has been successfully created. Um, so here we have the backup on iCloud and we also have the backup manually. But since we are making use of the backup on iCloud, we click on this. Now it asks us to impute the password that is going to be used to backup our file on the iCloud. Um, save pal one, two, three, four. Safe power one, two, three, four. So, guys, I just made use of this um, password for an instruction. It's basically, it might not be the same thing you'd like to make use of. So, it's just like for an instruction. And furthermore, an advice I'd implore you not to use the same password as that of your iCloud for this safe power backup because if your um, iCloud has been compromised or is compromised in one way or the other and the user is trying to like um, back up your safe pal um, via the iCloud it won't go through since it's different password so my advice is make use of different password as that of your um, iCloud so you don't get your wallet compromised if your iCloud main iCloud is being compromised so we click on next we'll have to accept this we'll back up our password cannot be changed or retrieved so it's a one-time setup when you set it up that's it your password can be changed so it will be better we note down the password probably in the notes or we write it down or maybe save it in some way you won't um, forget about it so we click on the last one then we start our backup and give it some um, seconds to upload to iCloud so that's it our wallet has been successfully backed up we we'll start making use of our wallet so this is it it has every features it's supposed to have um, so for us to we do this again so it will be more easier we click on software wallet we we'll create new we we'll create new wallet your safe power transaction key that's it we'll create another one we name it cloud 2 we continue wallet has been created so since we'd like to back up to iCloud we click on back up to iCloud safe power one 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 safe power so guys i'm just making use of this password for demonstration it's necessarily not the same password as you and also the password must be at least eight characters and both letters and numbers take note of this for it to be um successful because if it have to put maybe we didn't put it right so i'll just 
so it won't go through because it's an inconsistent password so be very sure of the password you are putting you can just open this to see safe power so that's it we'll click on next we we'll authorize this we we'll authorize this we we'll authorize that and we successfully back up our password remember we did um cloud one and cloud two so cloud two has been successfully backed up so now i want to delete cloud one i would like to remove cloud one so would like uh would um have to restore it from the iCloud backup so we we'll remove we delete repeat your password so cloud one has been deleted so for us to restore our cloud one we we'll click on here here this section we we'll click there we we'll click on add wallets add wallets we we'll click on software wallet software wallet we we'll click on restore with iCloud which is over here clicking on restore with iCloud you put your transaction password security sorry so that's it so we would like to restore cloud one which I Put the password as so that's it cloud one has been successfully um restored then let's delete cloud two cloud two has been successfully removed from the list so for us to add it back we'll do the same process we went through the other time add wallets software wallets we restore from iCloud click on your password um i iCloud that is cloud two click on it That's it. Our um, our wallet has been successfully retrieved. And there's some other thing. If you'd um, add a new wallet, maybe we create a new wallet, and we didn't back it up or we forgot we forget to back it up. Just click back, back up. Just create a wallet and just name it like that. So I forgot to back it up. Probably I skip or. I'd have to close my app and open it back. So the app is going to notify me that there is one of my wallets that hasn't been backed up, which is here, no backup yet. So it would be better for us to back it up. We just click on this, do your iCloud backup, and that's it. So this innovation is, is actually a, a, a very, very good one in the sense that innovation in crypto security is always developing to um, solve brown new problems and um, weaknesses and also to strengthen um, um, this safe power came up with the measures of iCloud backup of races as we all know that the security continues to advance so as the, tra um, the threats and theft of our, our tokens as well if we further properly don't save our phrases so for all this to be curbed, SafePower came up with this um, iCloud backup phrase and it has really been uh, very, very useful for someone like me that, that does, um, that use Bona wallet. I've just have to create several other wallets, back it up on my iCloud. I don't have to save my mnemonics down or phrases so it won't get compromised. Maybe it got stolen or got burnt or maybe any natural disaster occurs and probably flawed or any other thing so with this i have my faces on safe properly on my icloud and it's also giving me um it's also giving me um an assurance that my um faces are properly saved in the icloud and i don't have any 
um i don't have any cause to be afraid or so so thank you guys that will be all for today i hope you enjoyed the, the video and also take your time to give it a trial on your safe power app as well so you see how it works thanks bye bye